At this time, I invite the children of the congregation to come forward for the children's message. Good morning, young ones. How many of you guys know what it's like to be sick? Now, I think both of you have gone through bouts of sickness recently. Zayden was very recently. Zayden, was it fun to be sick? No, it was kind of a rough one. Yeah, there was a stomach bug that went through the Lodal household, I think. Um, your family faith has also gone through some illness. Um, we know that God says that there's no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. That means God does not punish you for your sins. He does not treat you as your sins deserve. So if something bad like an illness comes about, it could be a natural consequence like you're sharing a water cup with someone who's sick or you're around someone who's sick and the germs spread that way. But if you say, why does God allow this to happen to me? The answer for the Christian has to be that this is a blessing somehow. Now does it feel like a blessing, Zayden, when you were very sick and throwing up? Not so much. Nor I. I didn't feel like it was a blessing either. And yet somehow God promises to take this and work it out for your good. And some of what we talk about this when we're sick or when we're going through a hard time with friends, relationships, you name it. Life's rough. Is this cross that we bear as Christians. Now it's not wrong to pray to God, God, take this away from me. Because I don't like it. You could do that. But sometimes in life, and I'm just warning you, you guys haven't a lot of experience yet, sometimes these crosses don't go away right away. Sometimes you have to keep on carrying them for weeks. Maybe months or years you hear about stories from other people. And it's at that time when we, remind, we have to remind ourselves where I started this, this is not a punishment from God. Somehow God will allow this to be a blessing for you. And I think it's enough just to remind ourselves that we need to pray about it and to go back to Scripture and be reminded that when we get sick, that doesn't mean that God hates us. It means that He's still by our side and He allowed this to come into our life. We live in a sinful world surrounded by sinful people and we're clothed in sinful flesh. And the devil hates us. So bad things will happen to us a lot. So let's fold our hands and pray. Dear Jesus, Thank you for watching over Zayden and Faith when they were sick recently. Please be with all those who are suffering from illness during this time. Take those illnesses away, Lord. And when we go through any kind of trial, lead us back to you in prayer. And then take those trials away. In your mercy and in your time. Amen. You're excused to go to your Sunday school class.